or not carpooling is now illegal in Bengaluru after receiving complaints from an association that represents cab drivers. The transport department of Bengaluru has decided to declare that carpooling is illegal in the city. So essentially a vehicle that's not registered under the RTO cannot be used for carpooling. Why turn number plates essentially that are not registered cannot be used like cabs for business. So the authorities say that any attempts uh, to go ahead and carpool could lead to also action against them. Anaga Keshav is joining us live uh, in just a bit with more details on this. Uh, but these are essentially unregistered vehicles. And the messaging seems to be that for those who are going ahead and resorting to a carpooling business and not doing it voluntarily to help those who are along the same route to kind of curb pollution, to help traffic uh, woes ease, they're not the ones who will be punished. But those who are doing it as a business and earning money from it, they will face action if they're not registered under the RTO. This is a step that's been taken because Cab Drivers Association complained about these kind of illegal carpooling businesses. Anaga Keshav is joining us live with more details on this. Anaga, just explain this to us. Now, this is only a crackdown on illegal carpooling businesses. Yes, people who choose to do it on their own, uh, you know, of their own volition to curb pollution, to help traffic was in Bengaluru, who are traveling on the same road, that's still allowed. There's a lot of grey area to this matter. The main reason why carpooling is now illegal is because the vehicle that will be used for car, you know, for carpooling will not be RTO, uh, we know, will not be RTO registered. But if we go by that fact, even Rapidos and Ola bikes and Uber motor services that offer, uh, uh, you know, you know, that offer travel services via bikes, even they are not registered with RTO. So at this point, there is a lot of grey area. A lot more clarifications need to come to the fore. But at this point, carpooling services that you know that mainly have a white number plate and that is not registered with the RTO that is uh, you know that is illegal you can only ferry people you can you know you you can only ferry passengers provided you have a yellow board so this is a new development coming in from the transport department and if you do violate this 10,000 fine you know you know 10,000 rupees will be the fine that will be imposed we still okay. need a lot more confirmation on the amount but for now what we know is that the carpooling service is is you know you know is now illegal in Bangalore all right, uh, Araga, we'll see the impact of this. Will this data carpooling, will it affect traffic in Bengaluru? We'll track this closely. Thanks for the moment for joining us.